I own a lot of pairs of pants. I own gingham pants, I own plaid pants, I own corduroy pants, I own probably five pairs of blue jeans, one pair of black jeans, brown jeans, cream jeans, jeans that don't fit me, checkered jeans, like old fisherman pants, old like genie pants, some nice like baggy pants. I wear pants summer, autumn, winter, spring. I wear pants throughout the whole year. Even if it's really hot, I tend to wear pants. And I try not to, but it always happens. I feel more comfortable in nice pants. I've noticed that my channel has gotten a bit out of hand. There's been a lot of inappropriate videos on my channel, I don't know. There's just been a lot of like ditching school parties, schoolies on my channel and I want to take it back into what I like and I like fashion. So, so in this week's video, I'm going to try on every single pair of pants I own. Let's get started. Okay, so these are my pants. These are my pants. Um, I got some yellow pants. These pants, you know, bad. I feel guilty owning this many. My blue jeans. I've come outside because it's a really beautiful day and the lighting's nice and the background's nice. I'm trying on all my colorful pants outside because it's green and pretty. Let's go. I've got these nice green corduroy Offens jeans. As you can see, Offens. The Offense is my favorite brand. It's a brand made in Byron Bay. These are the one out of probably three pants I own that actually fit me without needing to wear a belt. Here's me just being an idiot trying to get the full length video of them. Next I'm trying on these Wagner jeans. Um, these I did get on sale from General Pants. They used to be a bright color pink but I think I washed them with a little bit of bleach so now they're pretty much white. They also have a rough cut um, bottom which I really really like. Me talking about how these pants are way too big for me so I can get the length. Um, pants are a real struggle for me to fit into but that's okay. <laughs> um, so here's me putting on a belt. The belt makes them fit really nicely and I like that baggy look. Color. I got these from a thrift shop for about two dollars I'm pretty sure. So these are actually old Target pants. They are actually really well made. These are another pair of Offense pants I got for Christmas. Um, they are my most favorite pants that I've ever owned. They're these nice light brown color. They fit really well around the waist um, and outline my booty. Um, but they are still a bit short, which is annoying. <laughs> um, but it's fine. You know, you gotta work with what you got. These are another pair of offense pants. They're a nice cream color, so they match a lot of things. The things about these pants are they're made of hemp, so they do wrinkle easily. And here's me wanting to be a TikTok star and wanting to know the dances, but not actually knowing them. So just giving up halfway through. TikTok dances. I don't know any. I know. Da, 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 da. So here's me talking about these pants, which are really sturdy, they're really nice and warm, would be nice for places like New York or like Japan or something. Um, they are way too big for me, I don't know why I brought them, but they were like a dollar from a thrift shop in Adelaide. Um, they look okay with a belt, but I really couldn't be bothered showing you with a belt on, so normally here I safety pin them down. Um, most of the time where I use bobby pins. I find a way. I tie them. I could wear them low-waisted like Yo, honey, gee. Here's me embarrassing myself trying to be a dancer. You know, never was one. Wanted to be one. <laughs> Curtsy. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. There we go. <laughs> These are some really nice pink flared jeans that I own that fit me really well around the waist but are extra too short for me. This is my last pair of colored pants. They're these yellow corduroy pants. Um, they roll up at the bottom. They're really nice. They're cute. They fit me quite nicely um, lengthwise, but see, since they fit me lengthwise, they don't fit me waistwise. Here's me kicking and jumping, really happy that these are my last pair of pants to wear outside. It was really hot. It's like 30 degrees too hot it's summer here in Australia and there's fires and floods and who knows what but it's cooler outside than it is inside so it is so hot okay that was all of these pants done I hope the voiceover wasn't too weird I don't know I feel like my voice is gonna change on the voiceover the reason I have so many pairs of pants is I thrift them all with my mum okay now I'm gonna show you my blue jeans my bedroom 
because it's way too hot with the aircon on. I own one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight pairs of denim jeans. So let's just quickly get started. So here I have some homemade double coloured denim jeans. Um, yeah, they kind of ripped. They, yeah, I didn't do them properly. I, I wanted them for a dress up party. I went in all double denim and yeah, this is the result of them now. I like them though. All my denim jeans are kind of the same. These are mum jeans. I should just do it like this. Hey guys, what's up? Five button denim jeans. Yeah, they're all basically, all my denim jeans are basically the same. These are kind of mid-rise, not high-waisted. I like them a lot. Um, I don't. I think I have an obsession. I'm. I can't. I think I have a really bad obsession with denim jeans. Here are some Levi's that I didn't know I owned. I thrifted these though. All my denim jeans I've thrifted except for one pair, which will be coming up. Soon. I did not realize how well these Levi's fit me. Um, I remember thrifting them, but Here are some fled blue jeans um maya's mum altered to fit me better so they fit me really well around the waist so and they are also flared i have a fun story about these ones i went to byron and got these ones in the shop i actually tried them on and they fit me perfectly but i forgot that i was on my period so i was extremely bloated so when I got off my period, I wasn't bloated anymore and now they don't fit me unless I'm on my period. So now they are my period pants. These are the only pairs of skinny jeans I own and I hate skinny jeans and it's way too hot. So I'm trying to put them on here, but it's just not working. It's, it's just not. And these are my black jeans. Found me at a 50 cent store, so these cost 50 cents. They are amazing, they are Levi's, and I wear them to all my parties. I used to wear them every single day of my life. I love them, they're still my favorite jeans in the world. Still need to wear a belt with them, but they are my precious and my pride. That was all my denim jeans done. I couldn't put my skinny jeans on, um, but oh my God, the oil. Look, I have straight hair. I'm sweating that much right now that my hair's going curly. Keep watching this video if you want to see more styles of pants that I own. It's too hard. Let me know if you're more of a pant person or a skirt and short person in the description below because it's literally like 30 degrees and I'm still willing to wear pants. Just let me know. I want to know. Sweet. Okay. <laughs> These are my gingham pants. Um, I really like them. These were my first pair of ging gingham pants I ever brought. Yep. Simples. I brought a chair in because I was that tired. These are them. Fun. Sweet. Awesome. Next pair of pants. These are another pair of gingham checkered pants that I thrifted and they're also flared. They are beautiful. These are my picnic pants. These are my grandpa pants. These are my pants that I look like a grandpa in. Next we have my favorite skater boy pants. They're just these green and blue gingham checkered pants that I safety pinned the back so they fit me better because I couldn't be bothered. <laughs> Nice. I have these jeans, the Smith jeans. Death, assure thee that no enemy shall ever take a life. I'm not wearing my glasses. These jeans fit me really nicely around the waist to make my booty look good. Here I have my work pants that I wear when I do like outside work and stuff. They're just my like day-to-day -day work pants. Yeah, these are just my work pants. I need to wear a belt with them obviously, but they're just nice. Okay, stop voice over me. I'm taking over for a second. These are my school pants. They've got like ugh, dusty bottoms where my butt used to sit on a chair for eight hours, six hours a day. They smell like me in school. They smell like strawberry chewing gum. As much as I hated school, pretty nice. And I miss it. These I call my frozen pants. These are my pants that remind me of a princess from Frozen. So I'm up to my comfy bottoms now and the lighting's pretty shit but I'm too hot and want to be on my bed while I try on my comfy clothes so let's go. So here are my American Apparel fisherman pants as I call them. They're just this nice rustic colour. They don't look good off but once you put them on they actually look quite nice I think. Next I have these similar green. This is like one of my favourite colours except for dark green. Um, they are pretty much exactly the same. They're really comfy, a little bit see-through but I love them. 
These next ones are pretty much the same. I got these from Thailand for $4. Um, they're just white. They're also really comfy. These are like my trackies. I wear trackies, but not as much as I do with these fisherman pants. And then I have two more left. These are my genie pants. These I got from a secondhand shop for like $2. I love them. They're like made, handmade in Indonesia. They are amazing. The, the pattern's really cute and they cuff in at the bottom. And lastly, I have these Nike trackies that were my brother's that he tried to sell, but I didn't want him to, so I stole them back. And I'm done. <sighs> Thank you for watching this week's video. I hope you liked it. I'm really tired and so sweaty. Subscribe, comment, follow my Instagram. It will be down below along with other stuff that's gonna be there too. This is the type of videos I wanna be making that I really like, but I don't know, if you like them, please let me know because I love making them. Maybe when it's not so hot, but I love making them. So just let me know. Please subscribe for more videos. And that's all, okay, thank you for watching, bye-bye.